Okay, so uh, to address the issue of torque, a lot of people ignore torque values and they just go with whatever feels right for no reason other than they don't have a torque wrench available. Uh, am I saying go out and spend $200, $400, $800 on a nice torque wrench? No, because you're only maybe going to use it uh, two or three times a year, if that. Uh, it's really important to use the correct torque on certain components like spark plugs. Uh, whether it be on a boat engine or your vehicle engine, uh, certain things, these manufacturers design these components to be torqued to a specific value uh, for a reason. Uh, you can strip threads out if you over torque them. You could uh, result in leaking if you under torque these things. It is not that hard to put yourself together a simple set of tools to accurately uh, determine the amount of torque that you're putting on a component. So I have here a few tools right here that you might need if you didn't have a torque wrench. All you need is a breaker bar or even a long ratchet will work, but something that's at least a foot long if you're going to be dealing in foot pounds. Uh, you need your arm. You need a way to measure the exact amount of uh, distance from the component. And then you also need a way to measure the amount of force exerted. Now I've chosen to use a fish scale here from Cabela's. Uh, you could use a luggage scale if you wanted to, but anything that's going to show you exactly how much force you're exerting uh, as a weight is going to work. Uh, torque is nothing more than a representation of the amount of force exerted across a distance. So if I'm working at one foot and I pull 10 pounds, I've exerted 10 foot pounds on that component. So just to illustrate real quick, I'll go ahead and hook up to this bolt here on the throttle of this engine. All right, I've got my scale ready to go and I'm going to hook up and just exert 10 pounds. Now I'm going to watch on the display until I reach 10 pounds. Boom, 10. And right there you know that you've exerted 10 foot pounds on that component. And whether it's a spark plug or a bolt, now you know without a doubt that you've exerted the prescribed amount of torque on your component. And that's torque.